You're my only friend, okay? Fuck it. Please become fresh water. You're all I have in the world. Please? Why do you hate your slip gator? What is up the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here. And just swimming in the shark infested waters of the straight of deep game, man. I hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a really good day. I've just been swimming because it feels so good. I don't know. Like, I would want to swim. And I feel safer now that we have our stick. We have a pointy stick. And that makes me feel safe. Is it becoming nighttime? Is the sun going down? I think it is. So, but we have a bed. It totally doesn't matter. We're on our paradisal. Paradisal? Is that a word? I like it. It's like paradise. A paradisal island. Can we sleep now? Okay, normally it would give me a message and say, nope. Oh, there it is. You can only sleep at night. All right, sorry. Wrong click. I was trying to Minecraft it. We can't Minecraft it. So today we're going to get some seven things done, man. It's time to get some crafting going, I think. And that means it's time to do some very exciting chopping down of the trees. Uh, all right, maybe we can sleep now that it's night. I think that it's awesome and amazing and super great, yes, that we can actually sleep in this game. Why wouldn't you want to sleep? Who doesn't want to sleep? It's the best thing ever. So... It's morning. Good morning. Feels like a good day to cut down this palm tree. So I think today, some of the goals, I have goals. We've set goals for today. And that's all you have to do when you're trying to survive on a desert island. Set goals. Goal number one, chop down a tree. Look at that. Think about how much we've already done already. 100% basically of the goals we've set so far, we've achieved. Goal number two, make logs. Done it. We are the most motivated, stranded, stranded, stranded desert island resident of all time. Today, we've set two goals and achieved both of them. We achieved the second goal twice already, and we continue to be amazing. Oh, whoops. Well, okay. Chink in the armor, Ted. We almost got there. So, what I want to do today is I want to make a fire pit, and I am, he I am hearing... I guess a lot of you guys maybe aren't playing. I don't know. Um, I think last episode I was like, give me some, uh, let me know about this and that. One person did. Oh, do you see that? I was like a ninja. I was like, get her. Um, they said that, yeah, you got to be careful on this raft because the sharks will get you. So, oh, is this raft still floaty? We don't want to be floaty. Sand rafting. We're extreme desert off-road islanding. Let's go back to this bad boy right here. We got a huge amount of coconuts. Let me give you an update. 702, number 17th, 108 degrees Fahrenheit. It's not super, that's really pretty hot. They survived three. Food, bad. So food is bad. Now, I think, I can't remember if I showed you this or not. Um, you can actually just like chuck these in the air and I think they break. You have to like really go at it. I've been going backwards like this, check it out. So you go like upside down. And it goes around behind you. Bam, no cutting necessary. And that actually is, oh, I'm full. That actually is really good because um, it takes durability, man. You know what I'm saying? Give me this back immediately. How am I doing? Hold on, wrong button. It's totally fine, we got it. Haunch is not so great. So we'll turn this thing into a regular coconut. Uh, Grab it, squirt. Uh, why are you no break? Break! Oh man, that wasn't like... I should throw that thing so damn far, man. Holy crap. So, we're getting a little brekkie. A little coconut. A little sriracha wouldn't be nice, would be bad with that, I think. Well, coconut sriracha kind of sounds gross. But it's a desert island, man. You need it. So, um, in order to make a fire pit, or to make the fire spit, that's what we want, because it allows us to cook food better, and it's way longer lasting. Um, we need a fire pit, three sticks, and one lashing. So in order to make a fire pit, yeah, it just says fire pit. Oh yeah, we need, yeah, I'm co sorry, I'm getting a little confused. We need a campfire and six rocks, and in order to make the campfire, we need five sticks. So that's what we're going for today first, with our uh, spooky floating axe, is we're going for our campfire. Come on, man, make it a thing. All right, so we got 
Uh, almost all of them already over there. Let's drag this guy like so and go ahead and make campfire. Now we've got our campfire. Let's set this over by our little living area here. This is kind of a cool little spot, don't you think? We'll set it right here. Not gonna light on fire or do anything like that. So now we need sticks. Let us chuck something on the ground here. We don't need this little wee flashlight. So we still have all of our other items. We still got our engine working towards getting uh, our amazing boat motor. That's what we really wanna get. Now, one of the things I'm interested to see is with the hammer, that's a stick, a rock, and a lashing, right? Can we make more rocks with the hammer? So, do we have any lashings? I don't. See, this game is gonna get, I'm telling you, man, after a while, like things like lashings and stuff are gonna be really valuable. You're gonna have to go, there's a damn shark. Kevin! Yeah, that's right, get out of here, man. This is our island. Don't even get near me, because we're going a little crazy. There's a stick. Come with me, the stick. Oh, wrong button. Let us drag the stick over here. So, the disembodied stick carrying is a little bit wacky. But I like it. I kind of like it. So there's our rock. I'm wondering if we take the rock. Wait, I was grabbing you, the rock. And a stick. We'll squirt him over here. we got to find a yucca plant. But that's the thing. I think that, like, after a while, you're going to kind of want to move around because... You're gonna run out of raw materials, you know what I mean? All right, so we got lashing, lashing, and we'll grab this stick too. Squirt over here in our special stick pile that we've created. Now this hammer thing is, like I said, it's rock stick lashing, right? No, give it to me. Lashing, throw down. Are you ready to craft stuff now? Oh man, you gotta be really careful. All right. No, not crude axe. Oh, crap. No, do not make that. One one stick. Oh, two rocks. Two rocks. This is super expensive. Pff, this is like the... This isn't Walmart. This is like the target of... of is target expensive? The Harris Teeter. It's like the Harris Teeter. Crude hammer. Got it. Aced it. So, let's go ahead and chuck our lashing down here. Let's remember that we've done that. Now we've got a hammer. Can we... Oh, you can't, like, use it at all. It must be used for making structures only. All right. Well, that's good. We need it. It's a thing. We'll stick it over here by, like, our good stuff. Place that. We'll just gingerly place it on the ground. I wish that I could get to placing things. Oh, did you see that? Hold on a second. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay. So you need the hammer to make, I bet you, the engine thing. Oh, that it flashes blue, too. So some of these items... I don't know what that is. Some of these items flash blue... When you... Oh, look what I've done! I made a table! Sweet! Can we put the lighter on the table? Oh my god, a little bedside table! So we can have all of our stuff! Well, it's a little wonky. Oh! Oh my god, I'm like the most amazing organizer of, of all time in Stranded Deep! Who? You can't get more organized than this! This is the most organized that there is! Ready? Watch this. Ready? Oh! Look at our little table! Isn't that the best little table ever? It's like all of our little things on the table. I want to move this over a little bit. Can I? Let's pick it up. Let's move it over here. Stand up. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, no, I ruined it. Oh, I ruined it all. All right, maybe we can, maybe we can fix it. Get over there. Stand up. Pretty good. We'll take it. All right, that's enough of that. All right, so that was cool. Um, I thought maybe you could break rocks with your hammer, but evidently that's not a thing. So that's totally fine. Um, I don't think we can break rocks with our axe either. So we're kind of at the mercy of the amount of rocks that we have in our area. So, all right, the other thing. Oh, you want to go? It's time. You're going down, Kevin. Come back here. I want to kill Kevin so bad. Oh, I got him! I'm sticking him! We're gonna do it, man. We're not gonna go too far away. We're gonna lure him in. I think we're gonna try to kill Kevin today. Come on, man. Ugh. Oh, man! Bring it on. Oh, I need air. Air! Is there air? 
So, I'm swimming as fast as I can. All right, I feel like his bursty speed is too much for me. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this, man. Oh, is that a second one? Holy crap, you're fast, man. Oh, I can't get him, man. All right, maybe I'm doing, let me just try this. Let's figure this out. Oh, I'm sucking it with the spear. Knife. I'm not hearing the little noise like I'm hitting him. So I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, my God. All right. I thought we could do that. I thought we could actually... Oh, 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 oh. Climb on this boat immediately. Why are you no climb on boat? Uh, did I not just climb on this boat earlier? No, no problem at all? Why are you being difficult, boat? Oh, that's so, that's so totally weird. All right, we can no longer climb on this boat, which we've already got into. I'm kind of getting in. That is so weird and moderately frustrating. So we can't kill Kevin, which we really, really want to do. And we can't get on this boat, which we really, really want to do. Hmm. All right. Never mind. I guess we're just going to kill, cancel all the plans, man. Cancel the party with Kevin and cancel the boat party. Those are, they're not happening today. Um, oh, rock. Valuable, valuable rock I have found you. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is start working on getting some stuff collected over here. Because like I said, we need to make the fire pit. So we need six rocks to do that. So actually what we'll do is we'll, we'll take our rocks and we'll bring them over here. And I think that what I'm going to have to do is probably get in the raft and go rafting for them. Like, I'm not going to have enough here on the island, I don't think. So, that's the plan. Find rocks, six rocks, and I'll be our bees. Oh, wait, I'll get, I'll, I'll get everything ready for the fire pit, and then I'll be right back. OMGs, guys, it's starting to rain. So, I thought I'd bring you back. Um, I got a bucket. I got back into the boat. It's starting to rain. It's really loud. I got back into the boat. I got a bucket. I got another knife. So a little kniffy here. I thought I had another one of those already. But I don't know. I can't find it. I got those bandages. And yeah, that was it. So, whoa, I dropped a bunch of other crap. So we're going to pick that back up. Pick up our crude axe. And I just kind of dropped some other stuff down here on the ground. When we go somewhere, we're going to, we'll pick it back up. But um, I thought I'd show you it's raining. I didn't know if it was going to storm or what or how this is going to work. It is uh, day four. As you can see, four days survived. We found four rocks. <laughs> so um, it's taken a little longer to find rocks than I thought. I got a couple more lashings. I organized some of my sticks, organized my coconuts. And um, so, yeah, but I don't have eight rocks on this island, which kind of is a little. Oh, and I found a potato plant, too, which we're going to go ahead and do that right now. I don't know what happens. I'm going to take a while, guys, to say we get potatoes from it. Cool. Potatoes. So we got three potatoes now, too. I can't figure out, I don't believe that there's like any other way to get rocks. You know what I mean? Like as far as, put our potatoes right over there. I don't think there's like any other way to get it besides finding them, I guess. Um, I also took a look really quick to like check in the water. Crab hole. That looks like a, or butt cloaca. Oh, and this is my other new favorite game. Check this out, ready? See you later, buddy. <laughs> this is my new favorite thing to do. This is what you do on a desert island when you're totally nothing to do. Oh, man. It's throwing crabs for distance. See how far we can get them to go. Let's go ahead and uh, take a look. Zoom. Oh, baby, man. That must be the coolest thing that happened to that crab all day. I bet you they all keep coming back so I can give them a ride again. They're like, did you guys ride that slipgate ride? Oh, oh, no. Casualty. He's okay. He's okay. Ugh. Oh, man, that was the longest one yet. So, um, yeah, I took a look down in the water here to see if you could find rocks, like, off the coast uh, a little bit, which would make perfect sense. But, yeah, it looks like there are there are no rocks out here. None that I can find, anyway. Um, but, yeah, that's our update from the island. Back to you, Kevin. Whale! There's a whale! No way! There's a friggin' whale, man! 
That is unbelievable! Oh my god, I'm swimming with whale! Hello, whale! What's your name? I love you, whale! Can you kill the whale? What? Oh, we're going away from our raft pretty far. Oh, we're kind of swimming. Uh, it's a little bit scary. Let's get back on the raft right away. There's a whale! Did you just guys see this whale? Did you say I'm in the swimming in the deep ocean with sharks? There's a whale. That is the most amazing thing of all time. Are there sharks? There's no sharks. I feel like we should just enjoy the whale for just a moment. Is he coming back? We're making friends. His name is Bobby Said. Not Bobby Said. Bob. Bobby Said would be a really neat, strange name for a whale. Maybe we'll call him Bobby Said. He's coming back. There's no sharks around either. What a super amazing thing. Oh, well, hello, little thing. Dude, can we climb on top of the whale? Get on the whale. Ride the whale! Why can't we ride a whale? Oh, can we? Oh, we're riding a whale! We're the whale rider! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, we're on its tail! Oh, we fell off his, his tail. It's not so great. Let us climb on his back again. He is the Krizak Sazerac. Oh my god! He's just chillaxing right here! Dude, blow your friggin' nose, Cloaca. Oh, he's taking off. He's taking off a little bit. Oh, can we ride him a little bit? We're riding the whale. Is this like a foul transportation system in this game? Oh, he's still Oh, he's diving. Holy crap, is he going? Oh, there's a shark. Oh my god. Disaster. Suddenly. Oh, he is going straight down. What the hell? Shark. Go! Paddle! Oh, he's coming up! He's doing the thing that whales do where they get stuff. Like, uh, with their baleen. Open up your baleen! There's a shark! Could you kill the shark, please, Bob? Where's our island? That's our island. Shark. This is the island we're going for, I think. Oh my god, crap. We have to get going. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh! Uh, just paddle! Paddle, 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 paddle. As the night falls on the ocean, and we paddle back to our island, Bobby said, came over to say hello to us. What up, Bobby said? Oh, Yeah, you can tell from his tail who he is, man. That's how, it's like their fingerprint. It's like a dog's nose. Same thing. But, yeah, we're out of here on the ocean at night now. It's uh, not the most terrifying thing of all time ever, really. Uh, yeah, we're going this way. We have the moon to guide us. Keep the moon on your right side. And, uh, hopefully we'll make it back. And I got a bunch of stuff. We got, uh, four rocks, seven rocks, eight lashings, and three potatoes from that island. So I think we have enough stuff and things to get... Yeah, we can get the fire pit going at the very least today. I thought, you know, I always have these grandiose goals that I'm like, we're gonna build, like, a whole thing, and we'll build a modern house today in Stranded Deep. But, um... It's not always that way, but I'm having so much fun, man. I can't believe we met into a whale. Is this a, it's a whale? And we're back, guys. And I gotta say, I think somebody's been here, man. Our engine's knocked over. Our table is all knocked over. I don't know. Something's going on. But what I did want to check out is I hear you can fill this bucket with water. Is it a thing? Is it real? Do you you know what probably would work better? If we hold it in our hand. Let's try that. <laughs> oh, it's green. Oh, I drank it. Crap. I didn't mean to drink the seawater. That was not that was not my intention. Oh no. How did we do? Uh it wasn't the best thing to do ever. So if we drop this. Uh I bet we need to use the fire pit to do it. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. So we need six rocks to make the the good fire pit. Come to me, rock. Become one with my spiritual, like it's total telekinesis. This is brain power right here, making it happen. Campfire, fire pit, do it. Bam! It's a fire pit. We did it. All right, now we need three sticks and a lashing. So let's go ahead and grab one lashing. We can actually just pick these up. <laughs> three sticks makes it a little bit easier. I'm just saying you can do it either way. You can use telekinesis or pick them up. It's fine. Do we did it! Oh my god, we 
We totally did it. This is the thing that's happening right now. Alright, so I dropped my lighter here earlier. Let's pick that bad boy up. Squirt it over there. Shoo! Now, this thing can be refilled. Um, I do believe. Let's go ahead and grab our crab here. So, can we... Ooh, it's like doing it! How is that even possible? It's like stuck on there. So, we picked it off. Now, it's still just a crab. Oh, strand deep. Alright, so we're cooking! Can we cook more than one thing at once? Because that would just be unbelievable if that was the case. No. Now I have two uncooked crabs. So I moved all my crabs over here. I went crab hunting. But we've got our fire pit now. Our campfire going. Now I have no idea how to tell if that thing's cooked or not. But I know that with this, it allows you to... You can attach your cookable food to it. And you don't need any attention, which I do believe that in certain other fires, I always just like managed my food, but I think it can like burn it or whatever. And then, I, like I said, this thing would be refilled, I guess. I don't know how that works. You could put palm fronds, I guess, and sticks in it too. But it's making it, it's doing a thing. Is, are you a cooked crab yet? What are you? Tell me. Ugh. Just a crab. You're just a crab. So it takes a while. We'll just leave that on there and let that do its thing. So it's cooking. We got our pile of crab now. Totally, I mean, we're set. Like, we could live forever. How? I mean, look, we've done all of it. We've made fire, done all these things. You know what I do want to try, though? After this thing is done cooking, uh, we're going to let that sit for a while. Is it almost? No, we still have tons of daylight left. Um, well, actually, you know what? Let me see here. Yeah, I need food. We're going to let this guy cook, but then what I want to try... Uh, I'll have to wait. Is I want to try and see if we can purify our water on it, too. So I'm going to eat a little bit of food, and I'll be our bees. And we're back. All right, we got this bucket. I think I get this now. So I was trying to click on the water to fill it, but actually it looks like what you do is you, like, go... You, like, got to swim with it a little bit. So you got to, like, submerge it. And then you'll see, like, see it fill up? Isn't that weird? I don't know. So that's the dynamic. That's what we're doing. So And then we have our fire spit. It's still working awesome. I cooked a crab in it, and you know what's really funny? Is that we'll stick that on here? Um, is that it makes a dinging noise <laughs> like a microwave when it's done? So um, and the crabs have metadata. So actually, what what that means is that um, as you're cooking them, if you take them off and put them on, it doesn't start again. Like it continues. Like there's a percentage. You can't see it, but not that I've been able to see. But um, like if we mouse over. Oh, did you hear it? Did you hear the ding? All right, let's get it. What is this? So now we have. Show me what you are. Bucket of fresh water. So now, can we, like, very gingerly set you down somewhere? Oh, 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 no, don't spill. All right, so now we have a bucket of fresh water. So I I think that, from what I understand, is that you can fill your water bottles up with this. So these get empty? Let's just drink it all. Now it's empty, right? Now if we... Oh, yes, it refills! See it? So we've refilled our water bottle. That is awesome, man. That is so cool. Let's pick this guy back up. So now it's like, whatever, not really that full. So we'll take it back into the ocean here. We'll submerge ourselves in order to fill up our bucket. <laughs> we can't just, like, bend over. You have to go for, for a dip. It's not bad, anyway. It's 108 degrees out. So let's go ahead and take a... By the way, it's day five. Five days survive. So we're going to get some more water going there. And I think that's going to be it for today, guys. You know what? We did a lot of stuff and things. We got all this stockpile. We're like total, uh, like a beach bum now. We got paddles and crabs and bandages and lighters and compasses and all sorts of crap over here. We got our bed. We got our fire pit. We met uh, Bob, I see. Bob, I think. Bob the freaking whale, man. And that was so unbelievable. So, I don't know. I had a good time hanging out. I hope that you guys do, did too. If you liked the video, make sure you hit the like button. Show your support for Stranded Deep and for Slipgator. Feel free to share your favorite videos you see fit. And may the stuff and things be with you. Come on, ding. The people are watching. Ding. Ding, stupid bucket.